This phone sucked. When I was younger, it didn't seem that bad to me. It felt like it felt like a funny movie. It was actually pretty good when I was younger. I mean, yeah, I wasn't. Oh my god! I could watch this film every day. Now. Right now, we will be reviewing. You know what? Uh, really, I don't feel like this old studio would work. <laughs> I should really tell the military about that. Forgot my happiness. Well, the thing that's gonna make me, that's gonna help me through this review. <laughs> so yes Scooby Doo You know what actually I think I'm gonna go backwards Wonder why? Because well I wanna see how they met Scooby Doo the mystery begins their second mystery, well, their mystery, and then, of course, the one I was supposed to review for the final end of it, but I'm still gonna have to read it. Well... Well, this film is no masterpiece. Just like, uh, another person's first. I'm calling this the first film, but another popular icon. First film. If that first stands for third, then I'm correct. So, yes. This one is no masterpiece. But. It's not anything like the original. This one at least has a few moments that was like. Did that really just happen? But they go back to first territory. Well, actually, kind of like the first cartoon. Sheep Mask. Yeah, Cheap Masks. Like. And yes, I can't say... I can't say I hate a, but the truth, there's no reason for my be. That song is actually pretty good, and, like, I listen to it. But, for every, for every film to be good, or TV show, there has to be bad elements. Well, let's just say this film does not disappoint. For one, 
the videos to the side. Though, though he does look a lot like the cartoon, there are a lot of Mama wet my pants scenes. Considering a lot of animation errors. And as much as I love the song, it some of them do take place in the scene that has without you there's no reason for my story. You and I. That's why it's called you and I. So yes, there are a lot of Mama what my pants. Is. So let's just move on to the ending. We'll be on the suspects. This movie tries so flipping hard to have suspects. Like the janitor who turns out spoiler alert not to be the not to be the person. I mean oh my god, I was so surprised when I learned he wasn't it. Instead he is a dancer. Is what I'm gonna be doing during the comments. Ping, 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 ping. So yes, cutting him out, you have two other suspects. And one day, did they even try? Did they even try to make this character the least bit nice? I mean, yes, at the ending, it's the prince. It's the principal, but the the other suspect. I don't know what he is, but <sighs> really, did you have? Did you have to, to do that? I mean. Yes, you made a suspect, but when you reveal it's not him, it's obvious who it is. So let's go on to why he's doing it. Which I don't really get it. It's a stamp. He's doing it for a stamp. Are you mother flipping kidding me? A stamp. But it's no ordinary stamp. It's a rare stamp. That doesn't change the fact that it's a flipping stamp. You blew a hole into your school. Your own school. Just to get a flipping stamp? Are you mad? But there is a very weird scene. The Fred and Velma scene. Are they a thing now? Let me look that up. Anything or Scooby and Scrappy stuff, but not Fred and Velma. Sick. I'm gonna need therapy after this, aren't I? Well, before I go into therapy, I'd like to finish this review. Do oh, you want to be in my review tattoo? Come here. Come here, buddy. Come here. You Scooby? You Scooby-Doo? Scooby-Dooby-Doo. Tattoo. Me some every now 
go ahead. You can go now. Or do you want to be in the review? <gasps> wake me up. Wake me up and I can't wake up. Wake me up and save me. Okay. There you go. So, yes. Bottom line is, it's no masterpiece, but it's not a piece of trash, like I said at the beginning. Next, we will be reviewing Scooby-Doo Monsters Unleashed. What are we doing after this? What are we doing after the films? Stay cool, Scooby-Doo. You mother! 